one awesome thing about this job is <laughs> I do get to see a lot of the country, oh, yeah. uh, landmarks, sightseeing. Oh, I get to do shit. I get to do my sightseeing with, with Beetlejuice. We, we call him Mr. Juice, though. They call me Mr. Lippers. Look at the size of that motherfucker. Damn. I think it's made out of fucking uh, sea rock or some shit. Yeah, it's time for a sea rock. Sea rock? Yeah. Well, if you make sea rock, it makes it when you, when you go over, when you make sea rock, it goes all the way over. And it's hard, it's hard to get over, though. All right, we're in St. Louis. The first order of business, there's this issue of the meet and greet. The venue apparently sold some extra tickets to these VIP customers, so the guys gotta get there a lot earlier than normal to sign autographs and shit. I don't think they're gonna be happy about it. tape right now? So I asked for a non-smoking room, because Sequoia, I don't like smoke, right? Yeah. This fucking guy, it's like, it. it's like he lit the mattress on fire. My fucking room stinks of smoke. I'm, in, I'm not in your room. I know, you're next door. What are you doing? You're, you're fucking blowing it over, over here or something like this? Beetle My, were you? Me? No, not me. You That's, are. He's so small that, that it just goes underneath the fucking walls. The you. fucking place smells like a goddamn tobacco we, uh, box. We, we had one cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> just leave my pills. I need, I need both of these bottles right now. Give me them. Just give me. I need them. <laughs> well, then uh, take them all. Hey, well, listen. What? This is serious, dude. Uh, now my hand is gonna smell listen, smoke. Listen, oh, shut the right fuck up, you're such a cunt. I, 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 listen, honestly, we have to go to the venue a lot earlier than, than I then thought. what? The show's we, at 9. We have a meet and greet, though. Yeah, we at meet, fucking, like, 8 or something. It's at 6.30. It's from 6.30 to 8.30. A meet and greet for fucking two hours. Right. Who, who came up with this fucking idea? Who the said two hours? The what? venue did it, and, and you agreed to it. I didn't agree to two, two hours. Two hours. Agreed, There's no, no way I would. Mind? Uh, you, uh, Why are you that shirt man? Because he's fucking smoking. Oh fucking! And you know, okay, fuck. I'll tell you what. Why don't we have the meet and greet and guests come right in here? They could smoke with Bob, put on his cologne. I can fan, Listen, fan the place. The deal we have with the venue is it is a two hour meet and greet from six thirty to eight thirty. Okay. What time's the show? It's at nine. We're we gonna read a book to these fucking people for two hours. They're gonna. What are they gonna do? I, They're just gonna look at us the whole fucking time. Really, they're just gonna stare at us after the first ten minutes. What, what are they gonna do? They're expecting us to be there. The what, people are there. But how are we? What are we gonna do for two hours with? Them? I don't know. I'm not. Don't get fucking loud. Don't I'm not fucking, getting loud. You're getting, dude. You're getting loud. I'm just I'm, trying to dude, fucking do my job. Because we're doing a two-hour meet and greet. This yeah, is ridiculous. Yeah. But that's what they, that's what you, is that that's what you agreed to do. I didn't, I no, never no, agreed. Yes, I would never have done. I told you, I, you that was part of the deal we made. The part of the deal was me doing a fucking show, not fucking, you know what I mean? Why don't we go to their house and paint it for them, too? Why don't we just take time to go and maybe we can cut their lawn, too? Dude. Dude, dude, at least, dude, that, won't dude. Be, at least that won't be two hours. <laughs> yeah, I know, we can get the lawn done in about 20 minutes. <laughs> Look, we have to just do it, okay? We have to just go there and do it. I, I don't want to go there that fucking early. I mean, I'm not gonna sit around all fucking day. What's the difference if you're sitting here or if you're sitting at the venue, honestly? Because I'm fucking relaxing. I'm not fucking have 10 people in my face going, what's Howard like off the air? How the fuck do I know? Exactly. You know what I mean? Am I right? Yeah, it's I fucking, there, I don't know right. how it's like off the floor. Yeah, I mean, no, just fucking, ridiculous. everybody just get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. I just want to be left alone. I'm right. not right. leaving. I'm not, I'm not, no, you're, you're fucking you're, leaving. Now, I don't want to fucking- You're kicking me out of your room? Get the fuck out. I don't want, I'm, I'm done right. with this shit. Do me a favor, don't smoke. I'm no, not you go back to your non-smoking fucking room, you raccoon looking fuck. I'm tired of his shit too, I'm just smoking. Yeah, yeah, you, you put Dude. a glove on, you cocksucker. What? Never mind. Fuck it. I'm, go ahead, let me get ready, because we gotta go, we gotta go. I'm not right? doing this two hour bullshit. Yeah, we do have to go. Pete, what are you doing, you gonna stay here? All right, go, go take a shower. Go take a shower. You go. I already took a shower, you fucking brick. <laughs> fuck you fucking yelling at me. Dog. No, go bring that. I'm taking this with me, and I'm going with it, and I'm taking it to the show, you fucking moron. All right, don't Jeez. You see, everybody's fucking cranky now. Yeah, I know. Well, that's because of this. Good one, Sequoia. Fucking brick. Fucking okay. off. Hey, can you move this fucking room before I swear to God I'm going to choke him out? Just stop smoking and stop taking that cologne, for Christ's sake. It's like a cancer ward for an old age home. I'm gonna fucking kill him, I swear to God. Let me get my phone. 
Bald blue cheese sticking in the girl's ass. <laughs> Got his fucking tongue out. Look at this shit. Hello? Stop smoking. You're a dick. Stop smoking. Hello? Hello, uh, hotel management. People are complaining, sir. There's a lot of smoke coming out of your room. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Oh, uh, you're gonna kill yourself with all that smoke first, sir. I gotta break the news to Shuli that he has to share a room with Beetlejuice again. And I feel really bad about this because it's definitely not fair. You sure this is my room? Yeah. Another fucking great operation you got going here. Here, zoom in on this. Oh, look at that. You fucking lucky prick. I know that bag. Dude, I I know you're gonna be pissed, dude. And I and I fucking I At know this it's point, like I don't even get pissed anymore. Like I'm just used to it. I'm just I know guy. it's not I'm fair. I'm just the guy who gets fed the shit sandwich every weekend. I know it's Whatever. not I know it's not fair, but I just didn't really know what else I could do, man. I mean it, God forbid you put him up with somebody else to fucking give a shit about him. Nobody else has that fucking in their body to fucking do that. So whatever. I'll do it again. As usual. Eat the fucking shit sandwich. Okay, listen, dude. I I promise you, I pre I re fucking very much appreciate you being cool about this, and I, and I give you my fucking word. I'll be cool about it till four in the morning where I gotta chase his fucking ass in the halls and keep him from walking home from fucking St. Louis uh, in, in the middle of the fucking night like I did in Texas last weekend. We gotta make sure he, he doesn't drink. If he doesn't drink, I can do this. Okay. Well, I give you, I give you my, I give you my fucking word, dude, that, that you won't have to share a room with them tomorrow night in Indianapolis. And, uh, this I gotta see. I I'm real curious to see who's gonna fucking sleep with him tomorrow night. Well, I, I, well I'll, I'll, fu I'll figure something out. I'll figure something out. There's another, we have a two hour meet and greet. It's kind of, from 6.30 to 8.30. Anyone in my family dead? You wanna throw me that bulletin while we're here, sitting here? Fucking good news balloon. Okay, we, uh, chewy situation. It's, he's being pretty cool about it. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do about tomorrow night, but we'll figure something out. Right now, uh, gotta get to the venue and uh, set up for this meet and greet thing. Sal and Bob are totally busting my balls about it. All right, stop filming and hop in the trunk. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking seatbelt. Put it on. Shut the fuck up. God forbid we lose you. Look at that. He's afraid it's gonna bump into his pacemaker. You guys down, be down to six dollars each. <laughs> We lose Bob, who would ankle tackle customers to sell him shirts yeah, at the front door. What are you waiting for me? Just keep the, no, keep the camera on him. I have nothing to do with this thing. <laughs> nothing. What's up? Thank you. I want to tell Howard the store to never ever again book me. The bitch has used my room to his shelly span and all of the sink in the fucking room and don't never ever again uh, book me with the touch of rolling fucking bitter juice. I can Have relate. a good day. More ways than one. You know, exactly. I mean, I don't really know how this is going to work. I mean, what are they going to do? Like walk out here or like sit on the fucking stage or like. What should we do? But times like this, you have to pretend like you fucking know what you're doing. I'm pretty good at that. I'm pretty good at pretending what I know what I'm doing. How are you guys doing tonight? Good. Fine, super, super. What do you want me to do? Do you want me to bring the people in here, or? You want to give them a few minutes? Let's, let's just relax. Give, okay. Go do the thing and. Uh, you mean? You mean get you shots? And give me a fucking real beer. Or something. All right, all right, I'm gonna get you some shots, and then, and then we have to start. We have to, I know we gotta get it. It's done on time, because look at Richard. He has to go to a funeral after this. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, okay. son. Come here. Okay. Come here, son. I love you. Oh, you're squeezing my back. You're breaking my back, you fuck. <laughs> Who's my son? I love you, baby. Try to break my back, you bitch. I love you. Who's... I ain't gonna have no back now. No, I wouldn't crush you. We're best friends. I'm the promoter for the show, and I need to get some shots for the for the for the comedians. Just make them make them like one and a half, not doubles. I don't I don't want them to get too fucked up this early. They're gonna get weird. Do you guys know who Beetlejuice is? He's a he's a short midget guy. If he comes down here, 
Do not serve him any hard alcohol. Just give him like Sprite or soda water, and I just put like one little drop of, 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 of I'm just gonna put one little, little drop. Okay, okay, come on. Down that, motherfucker. I ain't got Thank you. We're him out there. We're gonna, start, we're gonna start the meet and greet right now, which I don't know. I've never done this, so I don't even know what they do. All right, come on, why, why do I have to walk out first? All right, all right. In case they're throwing shit. Okay. The meet and greet is fucking, it's working. I mean, basically these people are fans and they wanted to see him, so it's nothing, there's not really any work involved. I don't know why I was stressing out about it. What am I gonna eat to? Some people like lime with their tequila. Dude, was the meet and greet that? It was fine. It was, it was fine. fine. Yeah. They were nice people. I don't know what the fuck you were causing shit about. Was it, no, well, was it too long? It didn't seem long. It didn't seem that long? Oh my god. <laughs> I wasn't meant to drink in one, at one time. Right, fuck you. And I'm the one that gets shit for drinking. <laughs> what is this? It's a what? Fun. What's so funny? What do you think it is? It's just a big garbage bag on the wall. But that means it doesn't work. Did it? All right, I'm just trying to figure out what I'm it is. It's fucking believable. Jeez. It's hot back here, isn't it isn't. Yeah, it's a little bit. That's why I'm trying to figure out what it is. <laughs> I, well, what it's a fucking air conditioning. <laughs> Don't get out of here. Oh. Get out of here. You're up to something. No, I'm not. I'm just checking the answer. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse my man. Excuse me. Yes, sir. Yeah. I have a lot of respect for that man. He's a family man. He's on my promoter. But I want to tell that Sequoia, people come to see this star, not the promoter. And I have a lot of respect for that man. He don't put the people on the seats. Killer comedian and a star put on the people on the seats. Don't get me wrong. He's not jackass. He's not jabroni. Promoter signs the check. And I have a lot of respect for that man. Take away that paycheck and let's see how much respect you have for this piece of shit, shit. She, come no. on, fuck him. No, 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 he's no, 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 I know, he's a jabroni, he's a promoter, but I tell him cross his face, people come to see this star, not the promoter. I'm not right. saying But also, he's not jabroni, look. Fucking bitch of juice or some another fucking a steam bag. Fuck all of them. St. Louis, make some fucking noise. Let's hear you. Come on. Listen, it was, a, it was a great night. It's yeah. fucking over. Yeah. Uh, we're going to uh, a strip a, pub. We're going to a strip bar. And um, you awesome fans are here. These, fan, these fans are taking us to a fucking strip bar. And uh, fuck, dude, we gotta. I just gotta make it fucking home early enough. And um, we're gonna go to Indianapolis tomorrow. It's time for the promoter to celebrate. Let's go. Let's do it. Stupidest thing I've ever seen in my fucking life. All right. The fuck were you thinking? I, I I need a photo of you, of you sponsoring. I'll get. You get a I'll photo of me smashing this over your fucking head. <laughs> <laughs>